Hey yo, hey yo, hey yo. Today is day number 36. Day number 36. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We have finished lunch. We had pizza sandwiches, which is uh, grilled toast bread. Grilled toast bread with pizza sauce, the spaghetti sauce, and cheese was yummy, yummy, yummy. Right? Okay, so day number three, so we finished quiet reading time. Riley is now reading, uh... Trap Daddy. Uh, trap! Reading, trap reading. him! No, don't trap him! Ah! He's trying to... Smack him, smack him, Anyways, day number three, we finished quiet reading time. Uh, we have finished lunch. We were supposed to go... We are going to go outside today since it's a beautiful day. But I think we're going to do a little backwards today. We're going to get science going. That way I can, uh, uh, yeah, we're gonna get science done and going, and then we'll go outside. So we'll see you in science class. All right, see you in the next one. Okay, uh, we're doing things a little differently. Like I said before, we are doing science today, and then we're gonna go outside for some fresh air and biking time. Uh, so we finished quiet read time, we finished lunch. Uh, kid did some of his work on his Chromebook. Today we are doing science oh, yeah. rules. Yeah, you did it in the computer in my room. That's yeah, fine. My computer was like almost dead. Okay. What a big boy I have. And my little girl. She got a little angry. She's in an angry mood. She's, she wants to smack me. And I say, don't raise your hands at people. We don't want to raise your hand at you. Does daddy raise my hand at you? Well, well wait, daddy. If I... If, if, if you don't raise, if, if, if I don't raise my hand, I can't ask questions. That asking question, raising your hand is fine, but threatening to hit is not okay because I don't know where you're learning that. Doing that's okay because daddy doesn't do that to you, mommy doesn't do that to you, nobody does that to you. I don't know why you're raising your hand, where you learn that from. But maybe on YouTube, but not from us. That's for sure. I don't know why you're going with raising your hand. Do you hear me? You don't raise your hand and hit people. We know that in this house, right? Okay, science. Science rules. Okay, so I got another printout to do for Caden, but we're going to share this one for now. It's exploration, STEAM, science, technology, engineering, art, and math. No, I want to read it. Okay, yeah. read it. This week, have some, have some free, free choice science books. Okay. 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 Really? Sounds looks like a thumb down. She's saying. You don't think it's gonna be good? Why has lost her voice? She's stuck in a bubble. I, I would think she's gonna say. Get out, Riley! All you can get out. Get out of that bubble! I'm gonna pop it. Oh, there you go. She popped it. Okay. Right. Continue on, what kid. What do you think it is? I don't know. We'll find out. I don't know. You don't know? Go online with some help from adult. Riley. That's me. For Riley, and find an experiment or steam activity of your choice. Below are, are a few suggestions for spring and living, living and non-living things related to activities that, that you might enjoy and want to test out. Plant your own seeds and make a greenhouse in a bag. Create a crawling paper caterpillar. Uh, create a crawling paper ca caterpillar. I, I thought the words were different. I think we should do that one. So, so it's, I, I want to make a greenhouse in a bag. You can do that too if you want. Get a build, choose your favorite animal and build a, ha a habitat for them. Design and create a non-living pet. Okay, so I turn the page. For more information on the above activities, please click on the links below. Okay, let's click on the link. Ready? Where's the link? Link below. Ready? That's the link. All right, yeah, there we go. We clicked on it and we got these. So we got growing beans in a bag. Okay, we can do that. Or we can do moving caterpillar. Or we can do build your own animal habitat, which this one's kind of hard to do. Let's get that one. Or my non-living pet. A lot of writing in that one. Hey. Oh, there's two of them. Ha <laughs> ha! Dad was prepared. There's yours, Riley. All right. So 
What is you guys choose to do? What do you I want? choose to make a greenhouse and a bag. What about you, Riley? Moving caterpillar. Moving caterpillar, okay. So, what we're going to need for Riley is going to be... Riley's going to have to get yourself some scissors. And Can you cut it? I'm so bad at I'll cut. I'll cut. I'll help you cut. Scissors. Help me. Help you. Help me. Help me. I'm nothing. Nothing. Okay, Riley, you, you, can you let me finish? Yeah. There's a lot of writing in that one. Oh, that's good for you. You should do it, too. Oh my gosh, so angry! Hey, why don't I tell you about raising hand? Who, who, who hits you? Raise your hand. Come on. Raising your hand. Moving cat. I said moving cat. I will. Will what? Anyways. That one time that you want. Okay, one time. I never... Actually, it was actually more than one time. Okay, well, listen. Let's not do that, okay? We don't hit user hands in this house, okay? Please. All right. Mm -hmm. All right, so Riley, you need to get yourself a construction paper. Construction paper? It should be asking me where it is. No, upstairs. I'll get it. We'll get it. We need to go on a hunt. So we need construction paper, a straw, and scissors for Riley. Okay? And Riley Kaden needs uh, something to grow. Kind of a bean. Which we can work on getting. And a bean. And a plastic bag. And some cotton ball. Why? He's going to make a greenhouse in a bag. All right. We'll show you after these messages. We'll be right back. Today is Pimentel Super Fun School. It's been brought to you by the letter G. G is for good. Good. Be good. Be good to your parents. Bye. Now, back to your regular schedule programming. We have finished our science and art and steam and all those fun things. We made uh, some kidney beans and a window for our... Our, our uh, plastic bag greenhouse, and we have made <laughs> our crawling pretty caterpillars. Hey, you guys want to have a little? So I'll show, show show everybody how it works. Ready, <laughs> <laughs> You take some straws and you blow the caterpillar. It's supposed to go up and down slowly if you blow it right. <laughs> Warm? Kaden's worm is slow. Oh, yes! <laughs> <laughs> go, caterpillar, go. Go turn into a butterfly. <laughs> oh, my. Oh, my. Oh, my. The caterpillar. And Kaden's caterpillar has what? <laughs> has a poop coming out of his butt. <laughs> no, you have to mow mine first. <laughs> All right. While they're playing with their caterpillar, the next thing we're going to be doing is going outside and getting some fresh air. That is science for today. And then we will come back and we'll have a snack after that. We'll see you in the next one. Bye. Okay, so we just finished outdoor time. Daddy cut the grass. The kids were playing on their bike up and down. I swept, cut the grass outside, blowed everything. Our nice, our nice apple tree is growing nice and big. And then Caden went inside with Riley, and then she, they just told me a big news that Caden's tooth fell out, right? <laughs> Yay! Tooth Fairy is coming today. Okay, so we're going inside. Uh, that's the end of day number 36. I know it's a short one. Um, and uh, that's the end of day number 36. And we will see you again tomorrow on day number 37 of the Pimentel Super Fun School. All right, guys. Peace.